Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys and today guys I'm going to, going to be talking about how to connect your Squarespace domain to Hostinger. This is something we're going to go ahead and see how to be able to do it so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end to make sure you count everything you need so that you know what your next step is. So yeah guys let's get straight into it. So what we want you to do first is go ahead and open up the official Squarespace website right here is squarespace.com if you've not already. After opening it up you'll be greeted by this main page right here which is the home page where you want to go ahead and log into your Squarespace account. So after logging into your account, you'll be greeted by the dashboard right here under which you can find all the websites you own and that you can access. And here I have my websites. So here at the top of the screen next to the dashboard, we have the domains section. Next to the domain section, guys, we can see currently I do not own any domains, but any domain that I own and any website with that domain is going to appear right here. So as you can see, guys, we have two options, either transfer a domain or get a domain. But these are options that you can only use for using a domain that you already own from somewhere else else like GoDaddy but it doesn't enable us to transfer to Hostinger. So basically guys as you can see on the forum of Squarespace somebody already asked how to connect the Squarespace registered domain to Hostinger but sadly they did not get any answer so it seems that for now it's not possible to do so. If it is then currently we do not have an answer right here on the forum. So what you'll have to do guys is to unlink your domain using the domain section right here. So find the domain you want to use for Hostinger and unlink it from Squarespace. You'll just need to go ahead and create a new domain so that you can go ahead and curl it directly link it right here to Hostinger so that you'll be able to use it because Squarespace still does not offer the option to link and connect it. But yeah, guys, basically that's what you can do. So I hope this video was helpful. If it was, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel. So guys, thanks for watching, take care and bye.